In this quick tip video, we're going to be looking at the array command. It is located under modified tab, modified panel, and the array command is right here. There's two types of array. So one type of array is a linear array. So if I was to select my object, which is the desk, and the shortcut is AR, you can either array linear or you can array in a radial. So if I was to array in linear, I select my endpoint and the distance between each desk if I want that to be one feet or I can make it every five feet or I have one and a half inches in between them I can simply go from here to here and I need two desks but that number can easily be 15 and I can have 15 desks in a row you can take the same desk array it You can take the, the desk by selecting them all through this window and type in AR and array them this way at a specific distance. And again, you can select that number. Unlike AutoCAD, these array, they're not locked and they're not grouped together. What that means is I can, I can select an individual array by itself, but I can also select the individual table by double clicking into it. You can remove certain desks if you were looking at circulation. And you can finish, and it would modify all of the array, uh, all of the array in between. Another type of array is when you have a fan, for example, and you have one of the fins. You select the fin and you simply type in AR. You can take the center of rotation and place it to the center of the fan. Now, in order to replicate this wing, we can specify the number to be 5. And at first, you're just specifying the division number. It will spread it across the same angle and divide it up. Once you have the specified angles and the number of division and number of fins you want, you can play around with the arch to mess with the distribution of the fins until it feels about right. Or you can go about calculating out the difference between each angle until it is approximately correct. That is one way to use a circular array command. Until next time, thank you. Please like, subscribe, and comment below.